difficult and challenging, that, that's, that's the most important thing that we're, we're getting out here. So exercise Raptor Strike is primarily uh, the 16th Regiment, uh, Royal Australian Artillery. Uh, we're utilising the range with a number of other units, namely units from 9 Brigade, uh, which is a nascent manoeuvre brigade within the Australian Army. Uh, we, uh, as, as the 111th Battery, as part of 16th Regiment, have been joined uh, by the Low Altitude Air Defence Platoon from the 3rd uh, Lad Battalion, that is here as part of the, the Marine Rotational Force, Darwin. We've been able to deploy on, on troop level tasks, which is inclusive of, of detachments deploying out uh, into both missile and sensor sites uh, and they are able to practice uh, their detachment level skills, improve on their own uh, individual understanding. This is a rare opportunity and noting that uh, the 16th Regiment is single air defence capability in the Australian Army, it provides a great opportunity for the rotational force to train on an exercise that uh, is supportive of the objectives of uh, an air defence course on. Working with the Australians, it, it just allows us to be confident in the fact that we can work side by side with them and that they can rely on us as well as we can rely on them. It just helps us work out these kinks so that when the time comes where they got to call on us or we got to call on them, that we're ready. The end goal for Exercise Raptor Strike is to share tactics, techniques and procedures as well as increasing lethality for us as a low altitude air defense detachment and increasing lethality for the Royal Australian Army's Air Defense Corps. Shared struggle increases friendships for a lifetime. And I, I think executing training events that are realistic, difficult and challenging, that, that's, that's the most important thing that we're, we're getting out here.